In this video, we're going to sketch the region of integration of this integral, and then we're going to switch the order of integration. Okay, so here's how it works. So here we have dy dx. That means first we integrate with respect to y, and then we integrate with respect to x. So the way to think about it is y is a function of x, right? So these limits will always have x's in them. And so whenever y is a function of x, we have a vertical rectangle, okay? Uh, if the dx dy is first, if dx is first, then x is a function of y, so you have horizontal rectangles. Anyways, dy dx, so we have functions of x. Let's go ahead and draw this region. So y is a function of x, so we're going from y equals x squared, looks like that, to y equals 36, which is a horizontal line. Boom, there it is. So that's going to be 36, and that's y equals x squared. Okay, so we're going from x squared to 36, and then we're integrating with respect to x from negative 6 to 6. Coincidentally, it's pretty easy to see that these are negative 6 and 6. If you square 6, you get 36, right? That, that, that y coordinate there is 6, 36. Likewise, here it would be negative 6, 36. Okay, so now we want to switch the order. Okay, so now we want to have f of x, y, and we want to go dx first and then dy second. So what we'll do is we'll draw a horizontal rectangle this time. Okay, and so now we're integrating uh, from here to here with respect to x, right? So x is a function of y, that's why you have horizontal rectangles. So if this is y equals x squared, if you solve for x, you would take the square root of both sides and you would get plus or minus the square root of y. So this function here, this is x equals the square root of y as a function of y. And this one here, this is x equals negative square root of y as a function of y. So we integrate with respect to x, okay, we're going from negative square root of y to square root of y. And then now we're going uh, with respect to y, so that would be from 0 uh, to 36. And so both of these integrals uh, should yield uh, the same area. I hope that made sense.